I'm Jessica Bruno in studio. Tonight, a new filing in the Donald Trump classified documents case is revealing a Mar-a-Lago IT worker will now be working with the prosecution in the case. Now, CNN has identified the worker as Yusil Tavares. According to the indictment, you might recall another Mar-a-Lago employee, one of Trump's co-defendants, approached Tavares saying, quote, the boss wanted security footage from Mar-a-Lago deleted. Now, this happened in June of 2022, which was after prosecutors had subpoenaed for the footage. I spoke with political science professor and attorney Alan Sanders today about this new development. It's significant because it shows that at least some people are starting to decide whether or not they want to be on the Trump team or whether they want to flip. And I think uh, that is worrisome uh, for Mr. Trump, that uh, there are people who now are willing uh, to change their story and to presumably tell the truth. Now, Tavares's former attorney, who is still representing one of Trump's co-defendants in that same filing, is asking that Tavares be blocked from testifying at trial. We'll, of course, keep you posted on that.